since you're from Texas, we got to talk about this restaurant that I saw on the internet. We're going to throw a picture up right here. But it was called the Coon Chicken Inn. And it's got like this Mammy cartoon as the logo. And I guess a lot of people were just like, this is offensive. And the people that own the restaurant were like, really? Like, come on. Like, it's 2017. Yeah. Like, how is this stuff still able mm -hmm. to just go on in a place like Texas? Like, yeah. <sighs> I mean, it happens. When I was in college, I went I went to the University of Houston. And it was this white girl in the theater with me. I was a theater major. Uh -huh. And she, I wanted to wash my clothes. And she was like, well, just come home with me. I'm going home tonight. And you, she lived like 30, 40 minutes away from campus or whatever. Uh -huh. And she was like, you can come home with me tonight and um, and I'm coming right back tomorrow. And I'm like, okay, cool. But you know, white people, you got to let people, you got to let your people know that black people are coming with right. you. You can't just right. show up with niggas. I don't like can that. Can I say niggas with niggas? Yeah. Yeah. You can't just show up with niggas. <laughs> she asked. Like. No, that's so true because. Uh, there's something me and another black person were talking about. I'm from Mississippi, so I, I know mm -hmm. I know what you mean. And because uh, I think it was the model Ashley Graham, like the mm -hmm. body positive model, she's awesome. But she she so she either she's dated or married to a black guy, and oh, she yes, posted yes. this post talking about how like um, how her family was like racist at first and didn't like him, and so she didn't tell them she was bringing a black guy home when she brought him home. And the thing is, I know white people, like when they date a black person, they want to seem like all progressive and nice, but also it shows how like, it's like a racial blinder, because you got to think about my safety. Yeah. Also, if your family verbally hates black people or talks about black people negative or is racist and you're just going to bring me home, you have to let me know these kind of things, because I might not be comfortable with that. I might not want yeah. to so yeah, I was just reading that. It's just kind of like I think a lot of white people get so caught up in being progressive that they forget about like my family's not progressive, just like yeah. I am. Yeah, you know? and so look, when I got to her house, she had there was mammy dolls all over the fucking house. Whoa, the dog like the big black like the, like they collected those like the, like the, the little angel thing like the uh, like 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 the uh, what's, what's the, the what's the angel thing the little uh, cherubs no the um. Precious moments like that shit, like wow, it was, like a the Christmas precious, ornament or something. Like they, these mammy dolls are everywhere, and I have to spend the night at this bitch's house because it wasn't no what wasn't no Uber. Wasn't no Uber then. Wow, that's uncomfortable. Yeah, that is crazy. It was. It was pretty. Crazy. They just had them everywhere. Yeah. What? Um, they what? had them everywhere. That makes. They just. I don't know. It just doesn't. Mm -hmm. Like, how did that not? I don't know. That's yeah. crazy. Yeah, Mammy dolls? Who collects those? Oh, 